Hello everyone, welcome to Infijan. In this video, we are going to solve one JE problem from uh, year 2003. Question is 1 plus i raised to the power n plus 1 minus i raised to the power n. How we will simplify it? So I am going to use complex number, complex analysis. 1 plus i or 1 minus i, right now you can see it is in rectangular form or Cartesian form. Second thing we will convert into using as you can see its power is n. So Demovie's theorem will come into the picture. That's why polar form is required. And third is what we will see the simplest the shortcut method. So let's get started. Number one rectangular and polar plot or polar form it is. Okay. In coordinate geometry, if any coordinate is a comma b, then we can understand this is a, this is b. Y axis, x axis, origin. Now come to polar form. In a unit circle, let me consider this is r this is theta then the vertical length it would be r sin theta and this horizontal will be r cos theta now compare both sides so a is equal to r cos theta cartesian into polar form or rectangular into polar form and b is equal to r sin theta. So what I am doing here, I am generalizing it. If suppose someone wants to convert Cartesian form into the polar form or rectangular form into polar form, how he can write. So if I will take the square and then add, so r square cos square theta plus r square sin square theta, that will be a square and b square. So simply take a square and add then r square will be equal to a square plus b square if i will divide second equation from one or first equation by second one means r sin theta over r cos theta then that value will be b over a so that means tan theta equal to from this equation we can find out theta and from this equation we will find out r okay so what i am going to do here 1 plus i i will write in the same form a is 1 b is 1 so i will write r will be r e raised to the power i theta or r cos theta plus i sin theta Okay. Now let us write the value. R is equal to under the root 1 square plus 1 square. So it is root 2. Tan theta is equal to 1 by 1. So equal to 1. So that means theta is equal to pi by 4. Put value. So it is equal to root 2 cos pi by 4 plus i sin pi by 4. See, this is the advantage of converting rectangular into polar. Similarly, I am not solving here. 1 minus i, I will write r e raised to the power minus i theta. So, that value will be same except the intermediate minus sign. pi by 4 minus i sin pi by 4. Okay. Now you can see the exponent is n. That means D movies will come into the picture. So let us put the value. D movies theorem we will apply. So I will write root 2 cos pi by 4 plus i sin pi by 4 whole power n. This is 1 plus i in polar form. 
प्लस रूट टू कॉस पाई बाई फोर माइनस आई साइन पाई बाई फोर होल पार एन अप्लाई डी मूवीज थोरम सो दैट एन विल कम इन साइड मीन्स दैट विल बी इन द मल्टीप्लीकेशन विथ थीटा सो इट विल बी टू रेज टू द पार एन बाई टू ब्रैकेट फर्स्ट ब्रैकेट विल गिव अस कॉस एन पाई बाई फोर प्लस आई साइन एन पाई बाई फोर सेकेंड ब्रैकेट विल गिव अस कॉस एन पाई बाई फोर माइनस आई साइन एन पाई बाई फोर Now you can see this term will get cancelled out. So it is left with two cos n pi by four, and here you are having n by two. So let's because of exponent, see two raised to the power n by two into two. So I will write n by two plus one. This is exponent into cos n pi by four. so our answer is about to come i can write this as if i will take lcm then 2 n plus 2 over 2 cos n pi by 4 so our answer is if i will write that denominator then i can write my answer root 2 power n plus 2 cosine n pi by 4 that is our correct and final answer now see the shortcut method shortcut method i will write 1 plus i whole square and then n by 2 now see 1 plus i whole square whole square n by 2 so it will be still n so what is the advantage that is 1 plus i whole square is 1 a square plus b square plus 2 ab so it is it will be 2i i square is minus 1 it will get cancelled out so it is 2i similarly second bracket will give us minus 2i you can check whole square i will write 1 plus i square minus 2i so term will get cancelled out minus 2i so this is 2i whole power n by 2 and second bracket will be minus 2i whole power n by 2 now let's take two common so that will be 2 raised to the power n by 2 will come out common so it is i power n by 2 Plus minus i par n by two. Now i par n by two. So i means cos pi by two. Let me write cos pi by two plus i sine pi by two whole par n. Similarly, cos pi by two. Minus i sine pi by two whole power n by two. It will be n by two. Okay. Now the movie's theorem. It will be n pi by four in the phase part. So two power n by two cos n pi by four plus i sine n pi by four. Plus cos n pi by four minus i sine n pi by four. You can see same steps now. It is repeating, and same result will come out. See this step is now identical from the previous one. So anything you, if you want, by the by the concept basis, you can do like that also, and in this manner also, you can write the exponent n as Times two into n by two. So both both ways you will be getting same result, and result will come out 
2 raised to the power see it is written there root 2 raised to the power n plus 2 cos n pi by 4 same thing i hope you like this video looking a bit complicated but it is not yet you will see then you will do it okay thank you so much for now we'll meet in the next mathematical video please do subscribe my channel and goodbye